One of the important things about the reuse message is that recycling is not going to do it for us, that it's not enough. Here we go on the road, that's all we have to know, cause we'd be steadily stomping at every show. Put your hands up, put your mic out and stand off the rooftop. Reuse! Hello from fabulous Stay Vocal headquarters. It's Alex Eves here. So the other day I was doing some cleaning and organizing of all of the different materials that I have here. And I came across this plastic bag. And it's not just any plastic bag. It's a pretty important one. And it is this plastic bag right here. So the contents of this bag are the scraps from what would become the last of the new canvas patches that I made for my apparel brand. And the bag itself is one of the last bags I ever took at a grocery store back in 2007. It was at the end of that year that I made the switch with my brand to a strictly reuse apparel brand. And because I'm the type of person who believes we should be living the slogans that we wear and that we sell, I decided to start living a reuse life. So for the past 13 years, I haven't taken a disposable bag, whether it's paper or plastic, at the grocery store. Back in 2006 and 2005 maybe actually, I started making canvas reusable bags. I stopped making them in 2008 when I made the switch, but they have lasted an incredibly long time. I still use them today. It's one easy change that I made in my life that has made a huge impact over the years. So imagine if just 10 of you watching this video decided to make that switch. Over the next 12 years, you would help save 36,000 plastic bags from being produced and kept out of a landfill. Now that's a huge impact. So this plastic bag right here, it's not just a plastic bag to me. It's an inspiration to keep going, keep reusing. Hopefully it's gonna be some inspiration to you too. And if you're looking for some more information, more inspiration, and more facts, head over to see the folks at the Center for Biological Diversity. I'm going to put the link below. They have a lot of great info. That's where I got the facts for this video. Thanks so much, everybody. Have a good one. Oh, I guess some of you might be wondering, why the heck is Alex keeping a plastic bag full of canvas scraps? Well, I'm not just going to toss that stuff out, and I have been able to use them over the years for various things like smaller patches, different projects, but I have an exciting collaboration with a local seamstress from Milton, Massachusetts that I'm going to be announcing soon, so stay tuned for that. We'll make ourselves a and we'll make